for it, yeah. Okay, so this is Papillon. This is uh, 3D printed eyes for interactive toys and robots. Um, what we're doing here is 3D printing eyes using a multi-material printer. Uh, as you can see in this uh, example I'm holding, we're able to print clear light pipes with uh, surrounding uh, a cladding material surrounding the uh, the, the, the pattern uh, pipes themselves. Can you get the? I'll try. Keep talking. Okay. Um, so what this allows us to do is to create a variety of, of uh, pixel arrangements on the surface of the eye. So traditional fiber optics are usually a hex grid that's extruded and just propped around to, to meet that, uh, that hemispherical shape. So you get a distortion of pixels towards the equator. What we're doing is using a Fibonacci sequence which is found in nature in dragonfly eyes. Uh, the, the planar uh, Fibonacci sequence is found in sunflower seeds. Um, uh, sunflowers, uh, and the reason that we're doing that is we can get even distribution of points throughout the, the hemisphere and one-to-one -one mapping from the projection surface to the display surface. So we've created these three characters. This is Iggy. He's just looping through some video showing text, um, uh, some animation stuff. This is Beep. He does hand tracking, so he'll look at my hand. Uh, oh, yep. Uh, just using a little prime sense camera on the base there. Uh, shows a few different emotions. He loves me. Uh, I, I guess I upset him because he gets sad. Uh, but just a fun little quick demo to show off the eyes. And then finally we have Boo, who is a party animal. We just need to wake him up. He's lazy. Uh, he likes disco, so I tap the beat and uh, he goes through a series of animations and uh, disco loops which kind of build up to uh, one big uh, culminating soundtrack. And that's it. Oh, give me a camera, not a video. Camera. Yeah, you're almost out. <laughs>